So you may already know about this tool, but it's a kind of plugin recommendation for After Effects. It's called True Comp Duplicator. Uh, if you have ever had issues where you duplicate a composition that's got sub compositions and sub sub compositions, uh, you know this issue, which is that basically the, the the top level comp that you duplicate does not. It's got all these nested dependencies inside of it, and so that that can cause issues. You think that you're you've got this clean, new, fresh thing that you can mess around with, and you mess around with it loads, and then you go back to the original comp that you duplicated, and you've messed loads of stuff up. True Comp dupl Duplicator solves this by sort of automating the comp duplication process. So I'll just put it really simply here, uh, so that you can see it in action. So here's the scripts on aescripts.com. Um, uh, we've got this main composition, uh, sorry, main composition here. So for example, I have all this intro stuff and then I get into the basically the tutorial side of things. And the, the tutorial side of things is where I edit stuff. So there's loads of like screencasts in here that are like time remapped to fit to the voiceover. Um, and uh, this might seem like, if you've never done this workflow, it might seem like far too much work, but like through the various scripts and workflows I've developed over the um, last few years, this is like perfect for me. It allows me to create a really densely packed tutorial aligned perfectly to a voiceover. And it's it's no more work than, um, than doing it in another way. So um, anyway, point being, we've got this top level comp and then like uh, a, a sort of a tutorial layer inside of it. Uh, and I want to duplicate this and start work on part two, right? So all I need to do is go to the top level one and with true, true comp duplicator open, I can uh, duplicate it. So uh, I've got a couple of things set here, select duplicates, update expressions, and increment the last number in names. If I hit duplicate selected, true comp duplicator, this is like a tongue twister, uh, goes through and it says, oh great, You've, here's your top level comp here. I'll rename it to part two, uh, part two SC, and then we've got it. And if we go in here and we deleted like everything, <laughs> if we go into part one, nothing is touched. And that would be the same also for the, uh, for the sub comp as well. So that's a recommendation for workflows uh, using true comp duplicator. Highly, highly recommend it. And if you're interested at all in this kind of like workflow that I have here, which looks like super um, like just hard work. When I first saw this way of working, I was like, why don't you just edit normally? Like this is insane. Like why do you edit like this in After Effects? Uh, it seemed like too much, but the workflows that I've got now uh, massively speed this up. Editing wise, I've developed a bunch of scripts for this. Um, I've shared a couple online, but just to kind of show you a really simple one time. The reason I, I stick around in, excuse me, After Effects for a lot of editing purposes is that just due to time remapping and obviously all the motion compositing on top, but like like editing in After Effects built in is terrible, right? But you can write scripts that do really simple things. So let's say I want to pause on this moment here uh, uh, for like one second, right? Uh, what I'd need to do is I'd need to Split the layer, enable time remapping on the first layer, put a hold keyframe on the first layer, move the layer forward and extend the previous layer forward, if that makes sense. I won't go through it because it will bore you, but for example, I've got this uh, JVN split um, script, which basically does that, right? And you can now be like, okay, that's my time, my time um, sort of pause there. And I can just like hold on that for as long as I want. So if you're interested in that, let me know and I can share more. But uh, as always, you can find uh, that script that I just mentioned uh, at uh, jackvaughan.com slash tools and um, truecompduplicator at aescripts.com. Highly recommend. Cheers.